Nowadays it is not easy to find a good dividend stock with a high yield. The pandemic of COVID is still going on. It's tough to tell which business will survive and which ones will go bankrupt. And which dividend stock or dividend fund is going to be able to keep paying out their dividend. In the quest for a monthly dividend payout I stumble upon Oxford Lane Capital Corp. Just to let you know I have this dividend stock also in my private portfolio. Currently this dividend stock is paying 0.0675 USD sent out monthly to its shareholders till March 31, 2021. With the current stock price of 4.99 United States dollars, the dividend yield is 17.27%, which is really high for a dividend stock. Before I go invest in Oxford Lane Capital Corp, let's find out what Oxford Lane Capital is, all about how have they been performing this year. Oxford Lane Capital Group Ox is a management team that manage a close-end funds the company makes money by investing CLOs. CLO stands for Collateralized Loan Obligations. In order to make profit they invest CLO debt and CLO equity, and manage the risk of CLOs tightly. CLOs are a bit more riskier loans than usual. And because they are more riskies, they pay more interest. The more interest is being paid, the more profits they make portfolio currently their investment portfolio is made out of 90% CLO equity and around 10% CLO debt. What are CLOs? CLOs are debts that are grouped together by loan originators, leveraged lenders, banks, and others, and are sold to investors as an investment package. There are some restrictions on CLO production. But the due diligence is very hard on these assets. For example, a bank lender or a business development corporation BDC, can look at a debtor's creditworthiness when they are planning on lending money. It's very hard to do the same for a CLO, as you have to check many people or businesses' credibility. It's not an easy thing to do. Profitability. Of Oxford Lane Capital Corp now let's take a look at their margins. For their latest quarter that ended in September 30, 2020. Their investment income was 31 million United States dollars. And their total expense was 11, 9 million United States dollars. So their profit margin is okay for me. Investment strategy group investment strategy involves shorting CLO stocks. Investing in Oxford Lane Capital Group stock isn't the same as owning bank stock. On one hand, it's similar to bank equity exposure to credit risk by obtaining OXLC. But, OXLC has a 2 20th fee structure that's more of an incentive structure than the structure than the one that's expected from your community bank. Based on OXLC's semi-annual report, it charges up to a 20% incentive fee, 2% of base management, and a 7% hurdle rate up to a provision. Dividend payout. Since 2011 the company has always paid out the dividends. It started paying quarterly dividends but since 2017 they pay the dividend monthly. The good news is that they have never missed out a payout date. Not even with the corona crisis. Although there was a huge panic. Many feared that they would stop paying dividends. But fortunately they could still pay. But here is the bad news. Because of Covid they had to slash 50% of the dividend in June because some of the debt owners couldn't pay their rent. As a result Oxford got lesser intra income by 50% net asset value of those class dropped also with 50%. And of course that had a huge impact on the stock price of Oxford Lane Capital Corp. Why I am going to buy Oxford Lane Capital stock for dividend. The main reason for this is because we are still in the middle of Corona pandemic. When this is over. Oxford will recover fine in stock price. Because when the economy is starting to recover more people and companies will be able to pay their interest rate on their loan. I expect a higher dividend payout once the economy is back to its feet. If you like this video then hit the subscribe and like button.